Connecting a iPad to a Windows laptop, it's really hard. But in this video, I'm going to show you how you can do that. And it's completely free, wireless, and it's really, really easy. Hey, what is up, everybody? And welcome to the channel. I'm Riz, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can connect your iPad, any iPad, by the way, to your laptop or Windows laptop and it's completely free it's wireless and it's really really easy yep let's dive right into it all right so the first thing you want to do on your iPad is to make sure your iPad is connected to some sort of a connection in this case you have options you can use uh, Wi-Fi you have mobile hotspot if you want to uh, you have options okay so once you connect your iPad in this case in this case, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to be using Wi-Fi. So let me just connect my iPhone to iPad. Let me connect my iPad to the uh, Wi-Fi and that's it. Once the iPad is connected to the uh, Wi-Fi, now we need to download a free app called AirDroid Cast. Really simple. Do not, by the way, do not download the AirDroid app. Download the AirDroid Cast app. Also, all the links will be in the description box below, so don't worry about it. Well, there you go. That's the uh, app right there. So let me just download it for, let me just quickly download it. There you go. There are multiple Android apps. So I want you to download the Android cast app, not the, uh, not the other one. So all the links will be in the, all the links will be in the description box below. Okay. So don't worry about that. Once the uh, app is downloaded, just wait for it. All right. So once the app is downloaded, that's all we need to do on the iPad. All right. So since we have downloaded the Android cast on the iPad, we have to do the same thing on the laptop. So to need to download something on your laptop, you need to have a connection. So as I said before, you have options. You can use hotspot if you want to. You have, if you have cable Ethernet, that is okay as well. If you have Wi-Fi, that is also good. In this case, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm gonna be using Wi-Fi and just make sure your laptop is connected to that Wi-Fi or the hotspot or the cable ethernet that you are providing. Once your laptop is connected to the same network as your iPad is, go to the uh, go to the Android Cast download website. By the way, don't worry, all the links will be in the description box below. It's a free tool. I've done this before, okay? So, once you are on this website, once you're on the website, click on the Windows icon and it should automatically download it for you as you can see at the bottom of your screen. So I'm going to cancel this one because I have done this pretty simple. As you can see, I have installed it as well. Really simple installation, nothing fancy at all. Really simple. It's free tool, so nothing fancy at all. Once the installation is done, just open the AirDroid cast. All right. So once the AirDroid cast is up and running on your laptop, you have two options. You have the barcode and an actual code right below the barcode. I'm gonna show you exactly how you can do this. So let's jump back to the iPad and let's do this. By the way, again, make sure your iPad and your laptop are on the same network, okay? That is really, really important. All right, so now what you wanna do is to open the AirDroid on your iPad. Now, once you open the AirDroid, just click continue. Mm, sure, sure, you can give access to the uh, to the uh, microphone so that way so that way your iPad is gonna work like a microphone the sound will be coming from the laptop I'm gonna show you exactly how, how that works okay once you are on this screen you have options as I said before you have the uh, you have the option to enter the code manually hold on all right so so you have the option to enter the code manually or you can also scan it as you can see, you have the option for the barcode and an actual code. So in this case, I was just gonna click on the scan the barcode. It's gonna ask, it's gonna ask for the camera. It's just it's gonna ask for the camera. So just click OK, and there you go. That that's how quick it was. That's how quick it was. It's connecting, and by the way, it's gonna ask you for the permission. So just click on allow. As you can see on your screen, click on allow, and there you go. It's connecting. So just wait for it. So just wait for it. It's gonna take a while, by the way, depending on how fast your internet connection is. Mine is really, really slow, so I apologize. All right, so there you go. You have the option. It's gonna ask for the permission, so just click OK. Give all the necessary permissions, as I have done this before. So now you have the option. 
All right, so now you have the option to start the broadcast. As you can see on your screen, just click on start the broadcast. It's gonna ask you again to start the broadcast. Just click start broadcast. It's gonna take three seconds. There you go, it is connected. It's connecting by the way, hold up. And there you go, it's connected. Hold on, let me just, let me show you how it works exactly. By the way, you can go full screen as well. As you can see, it's working pretty awesome. Pretty, pretty awesome, right? By the way, you can, uh, you can go full screen as well. There is no lag, I feel. There is no lag, pretty awesome. Just, you can, by the way, you can go full screen. Let me just mute myself because I can hear myself talking from my laptop. So let me just mute the audio, there you go. Now you can go full screen as well. There you go, pretty awesome, right? Also, if you want to tilt the screen, you can do that. It's gonna go full screen as well, there you go. Pretty, pretty awesome, right? And you have a lot of options, by the way. You can do a lot with this if you want to. As I said before, you have a lot of options. You can play games if you want to. You can uh, watch videos. You can watch YouTube if you want to. You can do literally anything you like. So for example, let's say I want to play a game. I'm just going to pop Clash of Clans and there you go. Pretty awesome, right? I can I can play games. I can I can watch videos. I can I can do whatever I want and it's really really smooth as well as you can see my town my town hall <laughs> by the way let me know if you play clash of clans as well I am uh, <laughs> I'm too old for this but anyways just just proving my point you have a lot of options you can play games you can play videos you can watch movies if you want to but um, that's it that's it for me but that's it, that's it for the video. By the way, if you want to stop this, really, really simple. You can look at the top right corner, you have the red icon, click on it, and it's gonna ask you to stop the broadcast. Just click on stop, and it's gonna stop it. There you go. Pretty simple, right? That was, well, that was pretty easy, right? It was well, pretty. that's it for the video. By the way, if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below. I will definitely, definitely get back to you, okay? But that's it for the video. If you like the video, please leave a like. Subscribe if you want to. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.